The inauguration of the refurbished and expanded 15-bed intensive care unit was performed on behalf of the board chairman UBTH Basharun Adedoja Dewolu by the Deputy Vice Chancellor University of Benin, Professor Ray Ozolua. It was witnessed by the representative of the managing director, Nigeria Liquefied Natural Gas Limited, Philip Nsherbila, who is the general manager, external relations and sustainable development, Andy Ode, Chief Medical Director, UBTH, Professor Darlington Obaseki, a dusted commissioner for health, Professor Beya Korea, Chief Medical Director. Ibunedo University Teaching Hospital, Professor Nosa Bazwaye, among other professionals in the healthcare system, representative of the general manager, Nigeria Liquefied Natural Gas Limited, Philip Nsherbila, and the Ode explained that the project estimated at 500 million US dollars followed a need assessment where the hospital's management identified the project and was approved by the NLNG board. For us, the objective clearly is impact that the interventions would make. On the one hand, are we going to see what's happening as a follow-up to ensure that where we've invested money on behalf of people in helping to build a better Nigeria, that happens, yes. There's a scheme to do a three-monthly review. Chief Medical Director, UBTH, Professor Darlington Obaseki, and representative of the board chairman, UBTH, Professor Ray Ozola, commended Nigeria Liquefied Natural Gas Limited for the investment aimed at accommodating more critically ill patients. They assured that the facility will be optimally utilized to address the oversubscription of the hospital's initial headbed intensive care unit. This doubling the capacity of our ability to care for critically ill patients now. We used to have a seven bed ICU, now we have an additional 15 beds. The lives that will be saved by this project cannot be quantified. All the uh, things needed to be put in place with respect to maintenance are already there. And so we rest assured that there will be no problem whatsoever with maintenance. In a ceremony prior to the inauguration, Chairman Project Steering Committee, NLNG, Charles Epele said equipping the hospital will further deepen its care for teaming subscribers across the country. Huge thanks to the board of Nigeria LNG Limited and the management for consistently translating the NLNG's dream and vision of helping to build a better Nigeria into a factual reality. The state-of-the-art intensive care unit was completed within an eight-month period. Kingsley Uchebu reporting.